Hello and welcome to Lightning Zeus. In this video, I'm going to be teaching Kane the Q search. Eventually, I'm going to build on this Q in order to create it into a task. The first thing you need to do is throw the treats on the floor and allow the dog to follow the track. Right now, I'm just working on him following the track of the treat successfully. Once I see he's being successful, then I add the cue. Make sure that you throw the treat one side and then to the other. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Share and message below. Moving along. You can continue this process about five times a day for about a minute. Go through each stage and please do not skip. Search! Because he has been successful at following the treat, and now I add the cue. Search! Search! As you throw it, you also say the cue. Search! Search! Search. 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 If the dog didn't Search. see where you threw the treat, simply just throw another one in the same location where you threw the last one. Right here you will see Kane searching under the couch and that's because there's a treat that actually fell under there. Now he's trying to reach it and get it, but the difficulty of reaching the treat is too difficult. Watch what will happen. Kane is now placing his head on his paw Search. to let me know the difficulty is too high. You can Search. see I'm throwing the treats and he's refusing to get them. If a dog feels like the level of difficulty is too high for him, he will quit the game. He's not going to want to do it anymore. If you continue to make the game very hard, he's not going to want to play anymore any other time you initiate the training. <laughs> 